Hi, welcome. My name is Mike. Typically, you're here for a three-minute wine tasting, but today we're doing things a little bit differently. Recently, I've been getting a lot of requests about the proper techniques to use for different styles of cork pullers. Today, we're going to demonstrate the proper technique to use for a sommelier's friend or waiter's friend wine opener. This was designed by a German fellow by the name of Wenke, W-E-I-N-K-E. Um, this has actually become known more frequently by, to anybody today as a wine key for that particular reason. It was called a wanky cork puller. Wanky just turned into wine key. So this, you can ask people for a wine key and they should be able to bring you this. It is so much better for servers, waiters, sommeliers, etc., to use because it has all the tools they need in one. It does have your worm or your screw. It has a double action, double lever um, lever on it. And most importantly, it has a foil cutter already built right in. So the server or sommelier pulls this out of their pocket and they have everything here to open the bottle table side for you. I've already removed the foil from the top of this bottle, but typically with this bottle that has a slightly longer cork in it than typical, um, a couple of things to bear in mind. You're going to want to take the worm and you're going to insert that into the cup of the cork and twist it in about halfway down the screw or down the worm. At that point, I'm going to take the lever, and I'm going to take the bottom portion of the lever and push that up against the edge of the glass, like so. Then what I'm going to do is I'm going to slowly lift on the arm to pull the cork straight upward. I'm going to then insert the worm a little bit further. You can go as far as you want, because this is a longer cork. And then I'm going to do the same thing. I'm going to take that edge, and I'm going to put it right up next to the rim of the glass. I'm going to pull straight upward. You want to continue to pull upward um, because if you start to move to the side, that's when you have the tendency to crack the cork and they get stuck inside. It's not absolutely possible to get it out, but it makes it more difficult. So again, you just pull it straight upward and the cork will pop right out for you. Please enjoy your wine responsibly and stop back in again for our next episode of the 3-Minute Wine Tasting. Have a great day.